Hello everyone. In this video, I will discuss some safety rules which you have to follow while working in laboratory. So, first, you should wear gloves and mask while working in the lab. Second, do not sniff any chemical. Means you should not inhale or smell any chemical that may be dangerous. The next, that disposal of the waste means you have to dispose of your waste properly because in lab there are different kind of waste and this waste may contain carcinogenic chemicals it may contain some radioactive element if you are working with the radioactivity so in that case you should have a proper facility for the disposal of waste you should not throw your lab waste into the municipal waste or you can say into your surrounding you should have a particular or you can specific uh, you should have the specific arrangement for the disposal of lab waste next rule that you should use the proper storage container means the container in which you are storing your chemical they should not be damaged or leak so you have you should have the proper facility for the storage of chemicals and next wear the proper lab attire means when you are working in the lab then you should wear the clothes which are specifically designed for the lab you, you should not you can say you should not wear some loose clothes you specifically you should wear your lab apron while working in the lab the next no food or drink in the lab means you should not eat and drink in the lab so whenever you want to eat or drink just go outside the lab but within the lab inside the lab there should not be any drinking or there should not be any eating so this rule must be followed because the from this food habits it may lead to the contamination in the lab so that's why you should not drink or eat in the lab next you should maintain good hygiene definitely in the lab when you are where you are working with the different chemicals and the different materials so you should maintain proper hygienic condition within the lab because if there is an any unhygiene that may lead to the contamination in your experiments so just to avoid the contamination your lab should be neat and clean next know the emergency exit routes it means that your lab should have some emergency exit routes and you also know about them because in case of any emergency like fire etc so you should know that from which exit you can run out of the lab so for that reason you should be familiar with the emergency exit routes next do not use cell phone in the lab yeah definitely using of mobile or you can say using of any kind of communication in the lab it is strictly prohibited do not use any cell phone in the lab next that next rule is you should label the chemical properly the labeling of the chemical should be correct and it should be neat so that everyone can read that labeling properly next follow the instructions to use the instrument means if you are using some instrument or some new instrument specifically so in that case first read their instruction that how to use the instrument then start using it because if you just without reading the instruction and just start using instrument so you may damage the instrument or you may use the instrument but you can say the reading which you get from the instrument that may not be accurate so just to use any instrument efficiently firstly read the instructions to use that instrument the next be aware of toxic chemical yeah definitely you should know that which chemicals are poisonous or which chemicals are toxic so that you can uh, you can use them with some special care and also mark on the chemical that it is toxic you can say the toxicity level should be marked on the chemical next do not use earbuds in the lab means you should not use any kind of earbud that may you can say if you want to clean your ear so that kind of bud you should not use in the lab next 
देर मस्ट बी अ फायर एक्सटिंग्विशन इन द लेबोरेटरी या डेफिनेटली इन केस ऑफ इमरजेंसी यू शुड हैव अ फायर एक्सटिंग्विशन सो दैट इट कैन बी यूज टू सप्रेस द फायर सो दैट फायर एक्सटिंग्विशन मस्ट बी देर एंड यू शुड ऑल्सो नो दैट हाउ यू कैन यूज दैट फायर एक्सटिंग्विशन so you should have a training to use the fire extinguisher so that you can use it while emergency next always use high quality lab ware definitely when you are working with uh, you can say with the glass wares or any kind of plastic ware so that lab ware they should be of high quality so that they should not get broken during the experiment and they should not release any kind of chemical to your solution so to just avoid these kind of situations your you can say your lab ware should be of very high quality and finally avoid dirty shoes and clothes in the lab you definitely you should not uh, enter with your dirty shoes in the labs and in the clothes so it is very much advisable that just remove your shoes outside the lab and then go inside and in case of clothes you should use proper lab attire while working in the lab as i told so these are certain some basic use rules which you should follow while working in the lab so this is all about the lab safety rule so see in the next video guys till then thank you very much